And so our story begins. The kingdom is on the verge of revolution. But who will be the hero to lead the rebellion? Of course, the princess. It is time you saw what your kingdom is truly like. of industry has come to Albion. Though some call it the age of oppression. When freedom is nothing but a dream, it's time to make a stand. To lead a rebellion. To be a hero. Welcome to the city of the downtrodden. Where those who dare to speak out are punished. And those who dare to hope find nothing to hope for. against all odds. True rebels never give up. Yet they cannot triumph alone. The uprising has begun. But who will lead the revolution? What a dreadfully sorry sight. Mm. Such a beautiful day to waste in bed, don't you agree? Oh, what? Go away, Jasper. Now, that is hardly the response of a princess. I'm afraid it is time to rise. With your permission, I shall wake your sleeping companion. Ah, yes, one's heart soars before such regal bearing. I trust you both slept well. You have a busy day ahead. Come on, boy. If I have to get up, so do you. It's not going to work. Don't look at me like that. Oh, very well. Good dog. What a pair. The kingdom is doomed. Now, madam, if you... Find some appropriate clothing for today's activities. Master Elliot is most eager to speak to you this morning and is waiting for you in the garden. No doubt you will wish to look your best for your young friend. I have taken the liberty of arranging two suitable outfits, if you would care to choose. Ah, 
splendid choice. I'm sure Master Elliot will approve. Perhaps you ought to make your way to him now. And I would recommend avoiding your brother today. Will do. Bye, Jasper. My princess. Princess. Nasty business down in the dust room. Ah, hello, princess. Greetings, my lady. Good day, princess. My lady. Oh, fierce warrior! Are you here to join my army? Good. We shall face all our enemies together, won't we? Yes, we will. Yes, we will. Then the kingdom is safe. Oh, our fair princess. Your two brave knights will protect you with their lives. <laughs> I can look after myself, you know. Really? I'm afraid I'll need some proof. Perhaps you... How's that? Oh, I don't know. I'm not sure how effective that will be in a real combat situation. I thought you'd never get up. Did Jasper tell you I wanted to speak to you? Yes. Did something happen? I'm not sure, but everyone in the castle seems to be upset with your brother. But more than usual. And it's even worse down in the city. You hear such terrible stories. Listen, they say a factory worker was executed this morning. I'm sure it's only a rumor, but you can imagine how people are talking. The staff in the castle are anxious. I told them you'd speak to them. Will you do that? I'm afraid of what might happen if someone doesn't calm things down. If you think it will help. I do. They may fear the king, but they still care for their princess. So, my good princess, may I take your hand and escort you to the castle? Everyone's waiting for you. Good. Now let's go. I can't believe your brother could have had a worker executed. But sometimes I think, well, that there's something wrong with him. He's changed so much, and he looks so tired all the time. I told Sir Walter about the speech. He'll be there to support you. I don't know what this place would be like without him. I'm sure he'll want to carry on with your instruction today. He seems obsessed with combat training lately. Trust I trust you well, madam. Welcome, your majesty. Such an honor to have you here today. The staff are convened to hear your words. Whenever you're ready. You are all privileged to work in this castle serving your country. You have standards to live up to, and I expect you to always do your best, no matter what the cost. These may be difficult times, but I will not tolerate any unrest or the spreading of wild rumors. Now back to work. Well, that was quite a speech. You were very commanding. Your brother would be pleased. But remember, Fear is not the only way to inspire loyalty. Right then, ready for today's training? Take good care of her, Walter. I suppose you've heard the rumors then. Well, I'm afraid they're quite true. Who knows what your brother will do next? In the meantime, the mood in the castle is getting more uneasy by the day. A lot of people.